What's, What's happening, happening fandoms? fandoms? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, we react to music videos and shows. Today, we get an interesting mix of oh, artists yeah. that we're very familiar with. We get postmodern jukebox covering Blackpink in a vintage ragtime style. I and they're going to they're going to do the did it did, did it do, do, do song. So I'm I'm looking forward to seeing how they make this into ragtime. I know, right? Because this is like a really fast song and upbeat. Yeah, I'm excited. So let's hit it right now. Oh. Is it just no singer? I don't know. We'll have to see. Interesting. Yeah, you can definitely hear the original song in it. Right. Um I doubt there's any any vocal. I, yeah, for this. I wish they I wish they had a vocalist. Yeah. Usually they do, and when they do, they they call them out as a feature in the top. Right. So I suspect we don't. Um so this is just gonna be just the musical cover, but, but it's, it's fun to see. Yeah, them. it's very interesting to see yeah. how they're they're going about it because uh I mean, the, that pianist is playing his heart Hot out. out. Yeah. He's just going so fast. Right. And uh, the the standing bass, bass cello, mm -hmm. um, he's definitely playing it up. He's got some facial expressions. Oh, yeah. And some moves. Mm -hmm. he, spent, some moves. he spun that bass. Yeah. This is kind of fun. I, I, I miss quite I miss the hit him with that did it did it do. Yeah. Though. I wish we <laughs> I wish they had found a way to incorporate a singer. That would have been cool. Go off. Okay, switch it up. Can't even sense of it now. Totally uh, different. Oh, I, yeah, I can still hear it. <laughs> Man, the, um, I'm surprised that that this works as well as it does. Yeah, it's um, it's totally twisting the genre. Obviously, I mean that's right. what that's what postmodern jukebox is famous for is exactly. just exactly utterly shifting a song into a completely, completely different, different space. space. Yeah, yeah, um, that's what they do best. Um, but I, it's hard to believe how well this works. Oh, yeah. And I, it's very entertaining. I'm loving how he's uh, doing the slap bass. Mm -hmm. He's doing some percussion with the body, body of the cello. Yeah. It's uh, very satisfying to, to see that. Like, very, very cool. Love that. Even the cello. The drummer is just super relaxed. Yeah. If I know the lyrics on this, I would have sing it with them. This 
this is one of my favorite songs for Blackpink too. Yeah. Well, there you go. <laughs> oh, man. Love this. I love the slap motions. Yeah. That's so out there. She's outlandish. Yeah. It's just so big. Very, very cool. Did you do too? Woo! Nice. Man, look at these guys. <laughs> <laughs> Wild Bill is the name of the guy on the standing base. Gotcha. I believe it. He was he was whipping his arms. I know, and like crazy. Getting big old wind ups for some of those slaps. I liked I loved the bass specifically in that. That was very, very cool. Congratulations to Wild Bill and I the know, others. Right? Very good, uh, very good episode of the Postmodern mm -hmm. Jukebox. Um, talk about, I mean, I really wish we'd had lyrics. I wish Why? they had brought in a lyricist for the, a vocalist for this. But um, I think it was still very well, it's good. it's kind of hard to do it because none of them could speak Korean. Probably, although I'm sure they could have found somebody that speaks Korean. Yeah. You know, there's lots of those out there. Yeah. Um, and I was watching you know, like some of the, the best Korean edition um, for the, you know, K-pop thing. Uh -huh. People sing them in Europe and also here too. Yeah. So it's yeah, just yeah. pretty incredible. They're, they're non, none of them are like, Korean, you know, descent, but they sing them. They learn the lyrics and how to sure. enunciate it. Yeah. Yeah, but but overall, it was just quite interesting and yeah. you know, making us feel the how it, it would be done in the past. In the essentially the '40s, the '40s yes. was the ragtime mm -hmm. era of really in American musical history. Right. So um, this is Pretty a version incredible. of this song that would have existed. 80, 80 years ago yeah. or something like that it's it's and they did an amazing job they i loved did. i loved the energy of the of the bass player specifically mm -hmm. the, piano the piano player was just doing going all the whole, off there yeah. was a whole lot of work that he was doing um, the drummer is the, just pretty relaxed yeah, the drummer was relaxed but he did a great job mm -hmm. there wasn't too much for him mm -hmm. but man the the focus was obviously on wild bill on that base oh yes very very cool well thank you again for turning into our channel don't forget to give you love and support to postmodern jukebox uh thank you for your love and support to our channel we really appreciate you guys by sending your recommendations and your suggestions please keep them coming thank you for loving our new channel and liking our new videos to get the algorithm going thank you for your love and support to our channel by subscribing by hitting that subscribe button um, to help our small and mighty channel grow. Thank you again and see, see you in the, the next, next video. video.